Okay, so that guy knew I was there. Maybe there's something important. Okay, okay, pick up stuff. A tree branch. It serves as a two-point weapon. Wooden branches such as these are pretty common, but it's surprisingly well-balanced. It doesn't do much damage, but can serve as a weapon in a pinch. Okay, and attack with your equipped weapon. Okay, okay. Ooh, ooh, collect stuff. Hylian shroom. Common shroom, mushroom. Found near trees around Hyrule, eat to restore half a heart. Okay, okay. And it broke. I like how things break here. They break really dramatically. Okay. Pick, I'm gonna, okay. Hold, and then, okay. Okay. That looks nice. I like the system. It actually feels really, um, really well organized. Let's put it that way. Oh, oh, can I put, oh, I can. Link. Yeah? Head for the point marked on the map in your Sheikah Slate. Oh, so, okay. So now you're Navi. Oh, Navi, however you want to call it. Open adventure log. Follow the Sheikah Slate. Great Plateau. Follow the Sheikah Slate. From out of nowhere, you hear a woman's voice speak to you. She instructs you to head to the marker displayed on the Sheikah Slate. The slate is both alien and somehow familiar to you. You find that you can access its map by pressing the minus button. Okay. But I... Okay. I wanna I wanna do this. Let's go. Ooh. It slid a lot. Okay. You gotta jump to grab him. Nice. I like that. Cool. Okay. Oh ho ho, well met stranger. It is rather unusual to see another soul in these parts. Who are you? Mm -hmm. Me? I'll spare you my life story. I like the beard. I'm just an old fool who has lived here alone for quite some time now. What brings a bright eyed young man like you to the to a place like this? Where are we? Answering a question with a question. That's fair enough. As I cannot imagine our meeting to be a simple coincidence, I shall tell you. This is the Great Plateau. According to the legend, to legend, this is the birthplace of the entire kingdom of Hyrule. Hmm. And that temple there, long ago, was the site of many, many sacred sac ceremonies. Ever since the decline of the kingdom 100 years ago, years ago, it has sat abandoned in a state of decay. Yet another forgotten entity, a mere ghost of its former self. I shall be here for some time. Please, let me know if I may be of service. And I'm going to steer it after. Baked apple. Direct heat has softened and sweetened this apple. Heat it to eat it to restore three quarters of a heart. I beg your pardon. I do believe that was that is my baked apple. You can't just go about taking whatever you please. Oh, 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 oh forgive me. I could not resist pulling your leg. Please help yourself. An apple, 
and an open flame make for a succulent tree. Okay, I already got way too close, so I know you can actually get too close. Torch. Okay. Uh, it's, it serves as a two-point weapon. This torch will stay lit once ignited, but if you put it away, the flame will be extinguished until you light it again. Aim. And, okay. If you hold it, you aim. Release it, you throw. All right. Well then, I just... Just help yourself to that torch there. And how, may I ask, are you planning to use it? Uh, hmm. As a weapon to set things on fire, or it's a secret? It's a secret. <clears throat> I see. Well then, do as you please. There are plenty of monsters ahead of here, though. Remember, you can use that as a weapon if need be. If need be. However, do not just swing it around without purpose. You must face your opponents and lock your sights on them. Yep, lock on. I already know that. Okay, um, no. Change that to that. Heat it up and go turn this on fire. Nice. I'm taking that axe. Woodcutter's axe. A three point weapon. Woodcutter's tool of choice for felling trees. It's, a for it's formidable weight and uneven balancing make it slow and make it a slow inefficient weapon okay I know there's a sword over there um, I guess I should go this way all right um oh you can already see wait let me see if I can oh what did I No. Yeah, haha, you found me. Huh? You're not Hestu. Uh, but you can see me. I didn't know your kite could see the children of the forest. Well, if you run into Hestu, please return this to him. A Korok seed. This small seed was given to you by a Korok. It has a distinct smell, but smell if you gather a bunch of them, you never know what may happen. Oh, and my friends are hiding in lots of different places, too. Don't be shy about poking your nose into suspicious places. Okay. Take that. Good thing it doesn't sink. And take this sword. Rusty broadsword. A six-point weapon. This once fearsome sword has seen better days. It can do some damage on the right hands, but also breaks quickly. All right, so that's like a weapon you use in emergencies. So you see that? That is interesting. Adventure log. Okay. Oh, because I, okay, that was my bad. I put it away. Temple of Time. Ah, uh, before I go on to the mission, I want to check this place out. So I'm gonna give it a full um, analysis, and I might. I'm. I guess I'm gonna skip most of it. So throw it. No, that wasn't how I wanted to throw it. But all right. This is trial and error. We're learning. All right. Uh oh. Whoa. Hey, hey. Take it easy. Um, I'm going to use this one. Oh, wait, wait, hey. Come on. Ooh, that looked nice. His Boko Club, a crude Bokoblin Boko club made of cl made to clobber small prey. It's, essen it's essentially a stick, so its durability is low. Oh, okay, what's that? Bokoblin horn. 
I didn't even read the description. My bad, guys. I'll read the next one if I can. Ooh, ooh, I like that. Open this. Hylian trousers. Three durability. I mean, three, um. Uh. Defense, I guess. Okay. That's nice. Alright. Which way do we go? We go that way or that way? Let's go this way. Uh, before I go inside, so two of these things here. And I'm liking how the music makes me understand that there's something important here. Oh, there's pots. There's pots. That's important. We gotta break pots. Arrows. Five arrows. Cool. Five common arrows. What's that? Traveler's bow. Good. Attack with the bow. Okay, draw a bow and release the fire. Okay, so if I do that. Ooh, oh, uh, nope. Don't throw it. Okay, so if you tap it, you actually take out your weapon if it's put away. To so throw it. Alright, um. I feel like there's some kind of cutscene that's gonna happen. Statue of the Goddess. Oh, we can pray? The Goddess statue smiles upon you. Hmm. What could prayer do in this game? Interesting. 